what's up? I'm Mac Holiday with Holiday What TV. Every day is a holiday. I don't make them up. They're real. For example, to, it's not funny. It's true. No. Uh, tomorrow is, uh, what is it? It's the 28th. It's National Public Sleeping Day. Yes! Yeah. Yes, it's true. So you can be sleeping at work. It's okay. Your boss can't say anything to you. It is not to be confused with National Public Having Sex Day, which is a holiday I'm working very hard to push through Congress. You're welcome. So, yes. Um, any, uh, any entrepreneurs in the house tonight? Yeah? Yeah. Well, uh, last week was National Entrepreneurship Week. Who likes saying entrepreneurship? Say with me, it's fun. Entrepreneurship. <laughs> right, that's what I'm saying. This guy is all about that. This is Michael Durant, the uh, CEO of Creating Genius, and he's all about the heartbeat of the entrepreneur and the startup. Your free beer sponsor, that's what I'm talking about. Yeah. Woo! So um, please, Michael, give them the down low on Creating Genius. I don't know if I can match the energy, but... Uh... It's not expected. It's not expected and not possible, please. Okay. <laughs> uh, we started Creating Genius. Uh, it was years of experience of working with customers all across the country, and we finally found a point from where we learned what not to do and what to do, and we called it, this is this place of genius. And we started learning that our clients were doing business, but they had no personality to their business. So we start focusing on the heartbeat of their business, but also we said if your business walked into a room, how would it walk? How would it talk? How would it, how would it interact? And that's what we start focusing on. Like, you know, you hear Ram Tough. That's a personality. Mm. So that's what we start focusing on. Nice, nice, nice. Uh, next month, which is like tomorrow, it's practically crazy, March already, uh, is International Expect Success Month. And you're all about mm. that. Yeah, it's true. It is. It really is. <laughs> what? Yeah. It's a holiday every day. What? Yeah. So uh, talk, you, know, you told me this thing about creative greed. You've labeled that, and I love it. Tell them. Uh, I mean, there's a lot of creative people here, I'm pretty sure. And if you ever had an idea or see, saw other people do an idea, and you feel like you had to do it also. And you walk away from the thing that you know how to do really well. And I kind of say it's like going to the buffet and figuring that you have to eat absolutely everything. Mm. Well, truthfully, why don't you just have that meal, focus on that, and, and being able to pull that forward more than just trying to do everything that you see everyone else do and just love what you do. I call it the in and out. I think I'm hungry. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> in and out burger. They do it burgers very well. That's all they focus on. They don't have right. tacos. That's where they live. Single That's focus. where you should. Single focus. There you I go. I like it. I like it. Uh, so I hear you're writing a book. He's writing a book. That's ambitious, right? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So why are you writing this book? Well, first of all, I'm recording it. I'm going to get someone else to write it. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. <laughs> no, but uh, the book is called The $2.5 Million Lesson. Why um, is it called that? <laughs> because that's how, much <laughs> <laughs> that's how much I had to lose to figure it out. You uh, lost that much. Um, Crazy. Yeah, it, it's called $2.5 Million Lesson, Living in the Gray Area. And there's a lot of people that, that are starting businesses uh, that they get the money in the account and they see the zeros, but they never think about now there's responsibility with that. And then you're also looking at your partnerships. You're looking at what do you do now with marketing and PR. It's, it's okay to try to figure out how to do a website. It's another thing when you realize that things are not working and you don't want to do it anymore. And you have people that have said yes to you. So the book is pretty much helping people understand those gray areas of entrepreneurship when you have money and when you don't. Mm, I love it. So uh, March is also uh, International <laughs> Ideas Month. I know you're all about the ideas of the people, of these people. So what does that mean to you, ideas? I want to find his website with all these holidays. Just, just go to my YouTube channel. Okay. Just subscribe to my show. Thank you. Go on. Uh, we, have, we have something on our wall that said there's, there's no lack of money. No one's burning money right now. The thing is, is there's a very few good ideas. Everyone's trying to do the exact same thing instead of finding something that they love to do and do it really well. There's a cartoon I get to watch with my kids. I think I watch it way too much, and it's called Robots. And it says, you know, one of the, the big robots says, see a need, fill a need. And so many times, if we were to look at what people are actually looking for and fill those needs, our business will become more like successful. Like see a need, fill a need. Yeah, I didn't, I didn't, I didn't coin that. That's the robot that show. That's the robot no, movie. You learn a lot from the kids' shows. Yeah, and cereal, too. We, and, yeah, of course. <laughs> uh, so lastly, um, why would an aspiring or an established entrepreneur be in touch with creating genius? What makes you guys different? Well, besides our business side, I really just had a passion to, to see uh, those that have dreams and ideas not have to go down the same road a lot of us go down, you know, and, and not have to lose it, 
uh, realize that you can do it without investors because you can lose yourself with now having to answer to someone else that has said, hey, here's the check, here's the zeros, go do it, but you truly lose who you are in the process. Mm. So, you know, we created a part of our company that, you know, any entrepreneur can call us, it's no cost. Anything that you're going through, we want to be able to help. And it's, uh, if you email us at uh, the elife at creatinggen.com, we'll answer any questions that you need. Yes, and you'll see the lower third element of your email right here on YouTube. Thanks, you guys. Michael Durant, <laughs> CEO of Creating Genius. What's up? I'm Matt Holiday. Happy Holiday!